Coming up next on Aaron's Outdoors. Everybody's ready to get out. Glad the rain's gone for a little while. There's the dump in the back. 56.4 yards. We ranged it. She's about to go crazy to see you. I'm so proud of you. Spur length. Did you see the trophies? Oh, no. Those are trophy spur length. This is Aaron's Outdoors. Kick it, guys. Aaron presents... Aaron's Outdoors, the outdoor adventures of the Brandon family. Give everybody a little taste. Well, boys, have y'all got your homework done? No. Well, at least y'all are honest. You got your work done? Yes, sir. You got a lot to do. Mayor Blake, you helping Toxie? Yes, sir. Toxie, you working? Yes, sir. Cole, you reading? Yes, sir. You're right. You don't know what you're doing, do you? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to do, Mayor Blake? Well, let's go turkey hunting. <laughs> All right. Airport. Let's go, guys. Hatch, you ready, buddy? Yes, sir. Oh, gosh. Gray, you ready to go? Mayor Blake. Hey, hey sweet girl. <laughs> who's, who's, is Mr. Pat, Mr. Mike, what are they doing? They better be scouting. Better be what? Scouting turkeys. Because me, Hatch, and Colin Gray better get one tomorrow. If you don't, is it whose fault is it? Mr. Mr. Pat's. It's Pat's Pat. fault. Woo, Pat. We're in West Tennessee, high cotton hunting. It's the day before the Tennessee youth season for turkey. Man, it's good to be back. Mike Barker. I'm glad to have you guys back. Mike, I, I know you've put a lot of time into uh, the preparation for a hunt like this. Uh, a lot of scouting, a lot of time in the field. Uh, tell us a little bit about how you prepare for that. Well, basically, this week right here, the, the weather's just not been in our favor. We've had winds that have been 40, 50, 60 miles an hour. We had, you know, one cold front come through yesterday. One cold front's pushing through right now. So what we've done is we've gone through and we've taken all our fields that we, you know, normally have turkeys in, and we find good roosting spots. We've put our Moultrie cameras up. So we got the cameras on the pinch points of the fields, so when the turkeys funnel through the fields, we're getting pictures of them to see you know, basically a bird count of what we have. Sure. And we've got a lot of ground here that, you know, we can't be on all of it at one time. So we use the cameras really to basically do the scouting for us, go out there and we check the cameras during the middle of the day when we're, you know, not expecting to see birds in the field, so we're not bumping the birds. Mike, you know, you talk about the game plan, and we've, we've talked about it a little bit here. Uh, I'm real comfortable with, with three of the spots. We've got uh, four of the kids in the game tomorrow morning. As you know, it's early spring here. It's, there's right. not a lot of cover yet. Oh, yeah. And, and we've got we've got a lot going on. You guys are just in such a unique situation here with the family and the children and everybody trying to get in there at one time. It's going to be tough. But, you know, we're, we're going to do what we can do, and I think we're going to see a lot of birds die tomorrow. Well, Mike, it's about that time of the afternoon. Let's go uh, put these birds to bed and, and get after it. That sounds like a game plan. got over here to one of our other farms it's not you know right there at the lodge but we see a lot of birds down in this bottom right here so what we're going to do is just we're going to be real quiet we're going to ease down this road we're going to get over there to work from glass to field and see what's down in there feeding so hopefully we'll pinpoint some birds to where you know we know we got them pinpointed in the spot for in the morning sounds good you want to walk from here yeah we're going to go right from here
You don't make it? Thanks, sir. Where's a little bit? Hey, sweet girl. All right, I'll see you up front, okay? All right, everybody ready? Yes, sir. What's next stop? High cotton hunting. High cotton hunting. Mom, you up front? I don't even see you. Take heavy coat, rain coat. Y'all going down at the bottom field? That last one, yeah, that big old field. Everybody's ready to get out. Glad the rain's gone for a little while. <laughs> He's down right there. <laughs> very big bird. This segment of Aaron's Outdoors is brought to you by our friends at Justin Boots. The next generation Just an Original Work Boots is packed with technology. Tough enough to handle the hardest jobs. Solid construction to keep you on your feet. Layers of comfort to get you through those 12 hour days. But most importantly, J Max boots are handcrafted in the USA. J Max, we put everything we have into them. To find a retailer near you, visit JustinWorkBoots.com. Confidence is critical in any shooting sport. Whether hunting or bench rest competition, you'll have confidence every time you pull the trigger on a McWhorter custom rifle. Their one half inch MOA guarantee assures tack driving accuracy on your next outing. McWhorter custom rifles, the most accurate hunting rifles in the world. Function, accuracy, reliability, every time. Find out more at McWhorterRifles.com. I wasn't born a four-time Super Bowl champion. It takes hard work, dedication, and the right fuel. I use Lean One to burn fat, build muscle, and get energized. Do you want to win? Get Lean now. For your free trial, go to FreeLeanOne.com or call 888-1453. That's 888-1453. Do you know what's in your energy drink? Altrosine. Sanctum gum. Blue carb. Glucoronolocotone. That doesn't sound so good. I don't even know what half this stuff is. Glucoro. Glucoro. They always say if you can't pronounce it, you probably should put it in your body. There is a better place to get your energy. So the ingredients in Bozzi. Raspberry. Blueberry. Pomegranate. Goji berry. Acai berry. Sea buckthorn. Jujube. <laughs> I'm a label reader. Super fruit powered energy. Why have energy for hours when you can have energy all day? Drink Bozzi. Don't worry, man. Did you sleep good? Yes, sir. What? We're going to take heavy coat, rain coat. The only thing is, you're saying that the, the slam dunk on the spurt is right here. Right. You probably want to put coal there. Jody's going to have hatch. They're going with Chris, y'all going down in the bottom field? That last, yeah, that big old field. Yeah, where well, y'all coyote going down there. Yeah. Um, Chad is going to take Jared and Gray, and Neil is going to run with y'all on the camera. Me, Pat, and Cole, we're going over to another farm that's north of here. And then my dad's going to take Toxie and Matt. I'm hoping that bird Bruce is just right there. Yeah. <clears throat> but they're just, man, they're, they're so I think we've got like three birds.
amazing though the amount of wildlife they have here and you really have to listen hard because you got the crows going on this morning you got the geese and the turkeys so you gotta you gotta listen closely but there's there's so much activity this morning everybody's ready to get out glad the rain's gone for a little while and I tell you it's just it's just a happening place this morning here at High Cotton do you think since it stopped raining we need to call a little bit? Yeah, I think they can probably hear us now. Go ahead and try a little bit. Miss Jody, there's some turkeys right there. Alright, be real still. Just let them come on in. There's about 20 of them. Alright, just let them come in. Be real still. If you can, go ahead and get your gun up real slow and easy. I hit him. He's down right there. He went right over there where we watched him. He was right here. I shot him. He went right there. So let's go look for him. All right, come on. Oh, yeah. Feathers. Oh, right here. Right all the feathers. All right, so Cause we saw him, he landed right over there. There he is, there he is. Look at the spurs. All right. He's a good Ooh. mature He definitely put a good shot on him. Look at all the feathers he knocked <laughs> We're gonna have to go let him up on the stealth and we're gonna have to go show it off. Show him off. <coughs> Maybe one of one of the other guys got one. <coughs> Just a little bit of calling just to see if we could get them interested. I just cannot wait to see these turkeys come out. Of them. You're gonna, you're gonna have to sh left handed right. Yeah, I can't, I can't shoot right handed right. I can't, I can't. This segment of Aaron's Outdoors is brought to you by our friends at Nutrition 53. Live like you mean it.